Fortnite is not. Man. Yeah, I, I, Fortnite is not like on my radar. I don't give a fuck about Fortnite. But watching the evolution of how it's changed, because I saw that they got. We already been known they've been getting the Star Wars. We already been known they've been getting like the Marvel characters, Dragon the DC Ball, characters, Naruto, and shit like that. Marvel, but yeah, DC. now they're starting to go like an anime yeah. direction. They're going so, anime hard. They're going anime hard now. I'm only thinking because I'm a futurist thinker. I like to think like anime. way, way far into the future. When Fortnite is eventually a uh, virtual reality realm, they're gonna have a. Mon I don't know if you could say monopoly because I don't know how their deals are structured with these companies in order to do these types of collaborations. But if these at a certain point become exclusive collaborations for the video game industry, they're going to have everything. Oh, yeah. This was very ready. Like Fortnite to me feels like pre VR ready player one. Like when you go in a lobby, yeah, you just yeah. see all these. You see Goku, yeah. you see Master Chief, you see Kratos, you see Doom Guy, you Everything. see a whole bunch of Naruto Every characters. possible reference. It's like crazy. It's literally Ready Player One. That's literally yeah. go into a Fortnite lobby and watch watch Ready Player One go into a Fortnite lobby. I swear it feels the same. It's yeah. kind of crazy. I was literally watching a video today when I was trying to research like what the fuck is going on with Fortnite, where it was like the nigga was like, okay, uh, I don't, I wouldn't, I didn't recognize the character that he was. Um, I'm not a big anime guy. But he was like some anime character, and then he like, you know, transformed into his, whatever his powers are, and he fucking sees Superman. Yeah, and, hero, and Superman yeah. originally is Clark Kent, and then he just transforms into Superman, and then they turn around the corner and they're like, "Oh shit, nigga, Goku!" And this nigga gets blasted. <laughs> I'm like, this video game has completely changed. Like, it's becoming kind of like how GTA is a little bit, where it's like everybody's able to just add like it's an entire world it's already virtual reality it's just not we're not wearing the glasses we're not like transported exactly. into it but you kind of like i think fortnite really is ahead of the sun like i'm not like other other people have done crossovers but they have committed i'm pretty sure they even said they want to they want to make a metaverse out of this whole thing eventually over time they got the money to do it man they rich as hell off the backs of mom's credit cards is epic is epic private I think they're private, but I, I can look this up. Epic Games Private Company. Private Company. I'm pretty sure they are. I, cause, dude, they're gonna make some. Money. They're already making money. Well, what um, other what other things do they have? Is it just Fortnite? Like, what other yeah, what other IP do they have? Well, they have it their own game owned. store like Steam. They have the, it is probably they have their own game store like Steam. So that's pretty big and they have a lot of exclusives so you have to use them um they're known for unreal tournament which is a very famous 90s game very famous i'm pretty sure they own that ip but is that, that unreal that engine that is that their property i believe so i believe unreal engine is them I'm pretty sure so they're pretty much like they they haven't monopolized the industry by any means of the yes. imagination but unreal engine is them Okay, but they have like an extreme stranglehold. Their market share is incredible. Is there any like what's the competitors? I'm only asking all these questions I to you because you you know more really about it. Unreal, bro. Unreal. I mean, there's other people who make their own proprietary engines, but everybody's moving over. Like Cyberpunk was a disaster because they had their own proprietary in engine that was awful. So they announced the Cyberpunk sequel, and they're like, "Oh, we're just gonna use Unreal." Like everybody's using Unreal. Have you seen like the demos for Unreal Engine 5? I think I showed you that Matrix one. The Matrix one I saw, 5. yeah, yeah. Shit looked mm -hmm. like it was real life. Like, yeah, it does. They got, they got, they got the industry in the chokehold. Cause it's like yeah. they say it's really easy to develop on. It's standard. Everybody uses it. It's easy to train people up on. So they got a strangle kind of on that kind of development side. Good God. The main games. Right, that's that's incredible. That's actually really incredible. Yeah, it's just been really amazing. I just wanted this to talk about it a little bit, just to get a little bit of a. Have you played it yet? No, I played it yesterday. Yeah, I played. Dude, it was so fun because, you know, in my. You gotta. I Come on, bro. Please watch three episodes of My Hero. Just three. You can drop it. I don't care. I need you to watch three. Just three. Just it three just episodes. doesn't sound like a good show. It's solid. I think it's better than Naruto. What's the rating? I love Naruto. Uh, Naruto is like probably like rated teen. It's probably rated teen. I don't think that's a good show for me. I think I need a little bit more but, mature. Uh, yeah, I. We're gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna talk about it but yeah let's move let's uh so yeah man like yeah i mean i think my hero man it's really fun man i mean like they have this you could like every time they bring the anime characters over they add items in the game so you can do a lot of their moves 
-hmm. So like the main character, he's kind of like a Superman kind of guy. That's why he had he was next to Superman. He just punches really hard and like fucks up buildings. When he punches like his hardest, it causes air pressure. He just destroys buildings. So you get this item where you go in the air and like punch people. I saw this dude and he had it in his hand. I had it in my hand. We went up at the same time and just clashed. I was like one of the sickest moments <laughs> I had in gaming in a long time. And I killed him. I got up. I was so hyped. I was like, damn. It's become a fantasy world. It's what we're doing, man. Fortnite? Yeah, it's become a fantasy world. I low-key yeah. kind of want to get into GTA 5 again because it's just like they've they've created this entire fucking fantasy realm where it's like it seems like you could do damn near anything in that shit now.